What is up, my good people? The name is Pixel Love, and we are back again with another episode of Mother 3. My frog, my guy frog, frog friend, my 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 little dude. He he's freaking the fuck out. Anyways, uh, I was actually originally going to plan to record this like right after the the last episode, but my neighbor's dogs just would not shut the fuck up. So much so that I'm pretty sure they ended up barking for like the next four or five hours that they're outside. So. Yeah, I really wish I could have recorded more, but you know what? I at least got the editing done that same day. So, anyways, in the last episode, we were tripping balls. We were tripping mad balls. Like, we had shrooms. Like, we were high as hell. And we tried to pull a needle, but, you, you, you know, so some things just don't end up like they're supposed to. Oh, would you look at that? Would you look at that? I will very much take all of these magic butterflies because even though it's been a while since I uh, since I last opened this, I am still a mess. I still do not have any HP or PSI power. So I need as much as I need. Thank you very much. I'm probably going to take a good while just going back and... Go Going back and going in, so I'm able to get as many butterflies as I can. But first, what is in here? Another butterfly! Would you look at that? <laughs> Thank you very much, Mixolydia. Missy, you've actually been... Well, I mean, I, I guess aside from Ionia, you have actually been the most useful Majipsy that I've met so far. Now, the real question is... Where in God's name is Ocho? Alright, everyone has max HP, max PSI powers. That's what I like to see, baby. It didn't even take that long. You were the guy with the RV! Wait, before, before I leave here, I want to I wanna leave something behind. To hell with the trivia cards. I, I seriously have not found any single use onto keeping them whatsoever. Now, the real question is, are, is there still going to be enemies that are going to be hunting me down? I feel like there, in theory there should be, but I hope that there isn't. Oh my, what is that? What is that? Well, <laughs> tiny, tiny hot spring further ahead. Be careful not to slip and fall in the sludge. The hot springs was here this entire time. No wonder Boney didn't want to go in here. Yeah, no wonder my boy did not want to go there at all. Cause he was like, he wasn't tripping that hard. And a bit of me was thinking, I was like, you know, where did the old man go? What, is there just, is there just like a 1 in 8 chance that an old man appears? How many times do I have to refresh it to get him? Or is this just one of those weird oddities that I'm just not able to see commonly? There we go. What's a good G? Yes. Oh. Well, that was it. Anyways, I was also thinking, I was like, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't spend all this time getting these butterflies. Maybe there's a hot spring over here. Because I did remember there's a hot spring over here, but I was just like, well, I'm almost done. So, you know, and I also don't know if the hot spring would be actually here. Lo and behold, this wasn't a hot spring that I, I this wasn't a hot spring that I thought it was. But I don't know. The point is, is that I'm able to get out of here safe and sound. Would you look at that? We still have enemies. And they still want to kill me! Oh, looks like they got rid of the mushrooms. Damn. Well, I can definitely tell you, we didn't get out of there unscathed. We definitely were getting our asses beaten to us. But you know what? With, with a few PK love omegas or... Nick and I talked over things, decided to go back outside, so now we're both back in our natural state. 
Nice! Good job on you, frog. Anyways, like I was saying, it, it's not Omega. What? What is it? What is it? Delta? Do I want to say it's Delta? DK love Delta? Whatever. Yeah, I just had to use a few of those. And well, yeah, Lucas's uh, PSI power is heavily depleted. The 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 idea is that we're here. We're we're here again. And would you look at that? It's Ocho. Mix Olivia instructed me to take you back to Tasmeli. I know I'm an octopus, but please get on. Hey, would you look at that? He's also a taxi. Come on, Boney. Oh, come on, boy. There's nothing to hold on to, but hold on tight. What, is he gonna be zooming like a boat? No. Oh, no, nothing like that. And eh, this isn't too bad either. As long as I don't have to fight those goddamn porkers, those oinkers, big people. As long as I don't have to do that. Good work today. Yeah, good work today. See you later. You look at that, it's all the O2 machines. Or mermen. Thank God I do not have to go through the, that demoralizing journey again. Ocho brought us back here to Tasmili. Thank you very much, Ocho. Now then, if you'll excuse me. I wonder where he's gonna go. Hope he does great things in life. Anyways, now that we're back here, Oscar Mayer over here, he's still just chills, just hanging out, just chilling out. So, Bronson. You got yourself a, a good tan over there, my G. Got some R and R too. Damn straight, I would like some R and R. I don't want a tan though. Just you know, just some revitalization, if you know what I mean. Hey, are you looking mighty good right there, my G? Now then, what do we do now? I remember correctly, I believe I was told that I need to go to Mapson. Now the question is, is Mapson in the place that I think he is in? Hey Alec, what are you doing here? Oh, Lucas. Slowly but steadily, the people of Tasmeli been heading into the big city. I didn't know you guys were still here though. Was that? You're looking for I Ionia's house? Certainly not nearby, I can tell you that. Do you remember my little cabin in the mountains where you used to come and visit? I was thinking about that. Are you telling me Ionia is there? To the west of the old cabin is Ar Argilla Pass. Oh! That little crevice over there! Whatever the case, it'd probably be a good idea to take a map. Ran into Mapson just a minute ago. He might be still around somewhere. Yes, Mapson. Where the hell are you? Oh, Reggie, no man, Reggie. Oh, Mapson, what's good? If you need something from the map-loving and map-owning Mapson, it must be a map, yes? I don't know anything about the Zeonia person, but I do know where Argilla passes. Let me map it to you. There, all right. I completely forgot. This has been the map-loving and map-owning Mapson. I completely forgot what was the button for me to what was the button for me to open the map? Uh, let me mash all the buttons real quickly. Found it! Found it! Found it! Argilla passes all the way over there. Um, all right. I guess I could go there. Everyone, you, everyone's going to the big city. You say, hmm? I'm the mayor here, which means I'll be one of the last people to leave for the big city. Even so, I really want to go. I should just ditch this miserable little village and be done with it. Oh, Lucas! You didn't hear me talking to myself just now, did you? Wow. What? Why does everyone want to go to the big city? Customers have all disappeared and even my own family has headed into the city. Not me, though. I can't just up and leave my store behind. What do you got over here? And it's all mid. Yeah, sorry, Thomas, but you're better off going to the big city. What about here in the Yado Inn? I was so scared of being forced to pay my hotel bill that I holed up inside my room. Finally, I worked up the resolve to not care what happened, so I stepped outside, and everyone was gone. Which means this hotel now belongs to me. 
This is what they mean by stepping outside your comfort zone will lead to greater things. Understand, kid? Learn by my examples. I went from a man with no money whatsoever to Hotel King. Welcome. Jeez, everyone in Tasmania really left for the big city? I'm stuck in this village because no one invited me to go with them. When did everyone suddenly get together to discuss leaving for the big city? My question is, I can't even go through there. My question is, is like, why? No one seems to be home. What? Is, is, no problem here. What? I can't look in the garbage can. Why did everyone leave Tasmania? What does, what does the big city have? Sparrow news: the people of Tas of Tasmania have been moving to New Pork City. One after the other, the results of this are as plain as day. The village is now silent and the liveliness gone. There are even rumors that Mayor Pusher is considering moving away soon. This has been Sparrow News. New Pork City? I mean, I've heard about that. You know, I play, I play Smash Bros, you know. I know that stage in New Pork City. We still can't move out because of my husband's job. Oh, why did he have to be the mayor of this stinky little village? Hold on there, G. Now, the real question is why is everyone going to the city? Why? This is just between you and me, but I've landed a new job in the city. I couldn't care less about the mayor and his wife. So I'm going to suddenly up and disappear in a day or two. Ah, busy, busy, so busy. Old man Wes, what's going on? Something's not right with the way everyone is suddenly moving to the big city. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, well, would you look at that? Everyone in this dinky little place has also moved to the big city from the looks of it. I mean, don't get me wrong. This place is pretty run down, but... Actually, it may be, it may be in our best interest to go to the big city. Maybe find some place better than this. Because... God, Im imagine living in in this condition right over here. Hopefully the city can provide something better, right? There's almost no one left in the village now. Even my ally and Nan just left for New Pork. Jeez. Rumor has it another stray dog I know became the master of his domain. That's got me curious now. Oh, so what, the stray dog is going to stay? Well, you, oinker. This training facility served its purpose. It's closed as of today. Once I close this gate, I'm off to New Park City too. This stupid thing refuses to close. Gah, come on! Uh, even, even the oinkers. They, they just left their radio behind. And the batteries are dead. What the hell, man? I can't believe anyone would want to leave this village. But, it's starting to get hard for me to stay too. And I can imagine when there's no one else over here, like why stay? I can see that. This annoying onlooker is not such a bad guy after all. He feels less and less a, a stranger as time goes on. I like this masked guy. He knows the score. He's got a nice mask too. Oh, no, 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 no. He does not have a nice mask. He has a terrible mask, by the way. Would you look at that? Flint says he doesn't want to go to the big city. Oh, thank God, Flint. Thank God you're the only one who knows. Nearly all the villagers have left. But well, yeah, I can tell. Your dad is still still looking for Klaus, even after all this time. Oh, come on, pops. Is he even? Is he still in here? No, I don't think he is. Damn. You know, I feel obligated to, like, be with Wes at this point in time because he was the first one who was like, Yeah, don't get these uh, funny little pink boxes or whatever they're, happy boxes, there we go. And now all of a sudden he's like, I have a bad feeling about this new pork city. What do we have over here? Is the lightning helping us? Thanks to all the lightning helping us from a popular city. Is this just the same? Yeah, this is just the same. This is just the same garbage I've already read before. But does that mean all of Tasmania is shutting down? Lighter fuel? I'm not sure what to do. It's a real dilemma. 
Should we head into the big city or should we stay behind and keep an eye on the village? I just can't decide. Don't worry, Dad. Whatever happens, happens. I'm glad to see little Fields growing, growing up into a big, strong man. You're doing great there, Lighter. God damn. What about Osoe? Is, is Nippolite even there or did he already move as well? Oh, would you look at that? There's the fridge. This is the white metal box you wrote here from Snowcat Mountain. Brave. Is this thing still open? It's still open. So would you look at that? Uh, I would very much like it if I maybe came back up again. Because I did not want it to go down. Thank you very much. Glad that took not so long. So we know Nippolite. His little shack burned down. He's still here. And no one may be gone, but even now she's watching over you and your family. Uh, thank you very much for the wise words, Nippolite. I want to know, are you going to the big city? There's no real reason for me to be in Osohei, so I don't know why the fuck I came back over here. I should stop dilly-dallying around. I need to go to Agrilla Pass and I need to find Ionia. And I need to get this needle out before this asshole masked man does it before I do. You know, I just realized, what about Isaac? Is Isaac still living here? Because I would assume so. There's a small notice board here. Going to the big city, see you all later. Oh, would you look at that? He's not- he, even he's not here. He's off to the big city. What's up, Arrow Lizard? Yes, please show me. Thank you, I already knew that, but I just wanted to see you do it. Move it, Buck! Oh, you're joking me. You're actually joking me. You have no business to attacking me. Sorry for the yawn. That, ladies and gentlemen, is why you need to yawn before all types of recordings. Get over here, bucko. Move it. All right, if I remember correctly, this, in theory, was the little... The little shack that Lighter and Fuel had that burned down, was it not? Would you look at that? It's... It looks like it's new! It honestly... I'm surprised that it looks like this. Saw some secretly living in, got blasted by lightning. Well... Maybe I shouldn't have said new, because I was thinking before, I was like... What did their house look like? And their house basically burned down, but I need to remember three years have passed by and they should have fixed it by now. So that isn't as new as I thought it was. Wrong way, it should be this way. Alright, buddies, move it. I have to go to a place importante that does not involve you people. Thank you very much. Would you look at that? Present! Bread roll! That is gonna be pointless to me. That is gonna be a flat 30 HP right then and there. I don't think it's here, right? No, it's definitely not here. But I just kinda wanna be a little cheeky. See what's over here. Oh wait, there's a rock. Uh, yeah, no, this is definitely not the place. Move it, bucko! Alright, Sparrow, what do you got? Let me explain skills. Are oh, you kidding me? I already know this little sparrow, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I wasted both of our, both of our time. God, you know what would really be useful right now if we had a rope snake. Hmm. Wonder whatever happened to that guy. All right, he's in the big city as well. Alright, this should be the place. Oh! I recognize this area. Ionia's house is north of here. The western path should lead us there. Let's go! Yeah, but I don't want to go... I don't want to go west. I want to go east really quickly. Whatever happened to Alex's house, I never got to see. Where is my grandfather's... house? Well... I knew he said he got struck by lightning, but come on now. 
Coming soon, Oriander Observatory. Oriander, my ass. I just really just had to send away my pops. Just like that, right? This was... This was where it all started. I saw Klaus... Where everything was... You no, know, nice and dandy. That was until the Fire Nation attacked. Well... I see a few rocks over there, so I'm gonna just clear them out. Ahead, a gorilla pass. I know how you feel, but stay away. What about this one? Also known as Stumble Pass. Be careful not to drop anything. Um. Okay. What was that? What actually was that? <laughs> Whoa! We really did stumble! Huh? Where'd the jar of yummy pickles go? Did we drop it? Though I guess that's what happens when it's easy to drop and easy to roll around. Should be hard to find. Split up and look for it. Bonnie, you have to. My brother in Christ. Criminy. I'm Bony. Yo. <laughs> look at that. That's so cute. Found something hard. I'm Bony! I'm THE Bony. The hard thing was they made you look. Oh, come on. I made you look? You're joking me. How about this, boy? Found something that looks delicious. Take it to Lucas. Alright, I guess you don't want I guess you don't want to help or anything like that. Um, nut bread! I'm Bony! <laughs> I almost feel like I should make that the title of this episode. I'm Bony. <laughs> I mean, look at him! When can you ever do this in any other game? Come on now! What do you got here, boy? Found something soft. A fresh mint. Eh, it could be worse. But it could be better as well. I thought we'd find it pretty quick, but what about this? Found something small. Oh, is it a nut? A heavy charm? What? I'm bony. I'm still I'm still gonna say that till the end of dawn. I don't know what it was, but it was just something that I dig up. Sour looking thing. Let's go. Jar of yummy pickles. Let's go. And I'm no longer bony. God damn it. The dream is gone. Let me guess. Once I go up north over here, I'm gonna stumble really quickly again. No! Interesting! There's no need to rush. Five seconds rejuvenates a gorilla, spring water, an extra syllable. Yeah, but I don't really need the spring water. I'm fine. I'm perfectly fine as is. Nope, not fine there. Not fine there. Note to self, I need to remember that I need to take out this tree as the last person. Or else i am they're just gonna burst into flames. Now then. That spring water? Starting to look- Starting to sound mighty fine right now, if I do say so myself. Alright, what do we have over here? Seems like you're very... Oh, you're joking me. I didn't even have the time to fucking ramp up my freaking run. There we go. God, I, words just cannot come out of my mouth. But on the bright side, those are some nasty combos that I had. My God. And I can't bulldoze through them. Well, well thank God that there's maps over here. Cave map. That is quite a big cave map over there. Uh, I am kind of a little upset at how much PSI power I've already used just getting all the way over here. So, yep. What? What is that? What the fuck is that? That looks disturbing as hell. And he's still not dead. Oh, really? You use PSI counter? Oh, whoopee, buddy! 
I don't think any of this is PSI though. And I'm surprised at how much- Of course you would headbutt. Of course half the head over here would headbutt. How much health do you have? My lord! How much health do you hold in that head? Jesus. Do I need to like paralyze you or something? Am I under leveled again? Okay, this doesn't look good. Never mind. I guess I'm just too used to. Oh no, not another hefty head. Please, no, 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 not another hefty head. I guess I'm just too used to other games in which the slopes just basically mean it's one way only, but. Alright. God damn these hefty heads. Alright, what do you got, Kumatora? Brain shock omega, cool. One, two, three. Fuck! Well, Lucas is really down on his PSI powers now. All because of these damn hefty heads. I'm not gonna bother with that, I'm gonna just go over here. Oh, would you look at that? I found it was the right path! It was the right path all along. I'll take that. That has to be the song of the uh, Majipsy's house or whatnot. But which way? Am I supposed to go this way? No, not this way. Definitely not this way. I feel like that way is to the needle. It is this way. Am I right? Am I right, Mr. Frog? Please tell me am I right. We are here in Mount Oriander. Let's go! Eonia's house. Alright. And would you look at that? A mole cricket here. Thank god I was able to get my money first before I talked to him because he's just not gonna shut up. And would you look at that? He still does not is not selling the goods. Come on, dog! Also, I just realized that Boney actually has this heavy charm and I almost feel obligated to give it to Lucas but at the same time I kind of need to figure out who actually really needs it. Let's see, Lucas has 119 defense, Kumatora 112, Duster 121. I could give it to Kumatora. It might be in my best interest to actually do that. Because like, Lucas and Duster are somewhat similar. You know, it's negligible. Boney's defense is just awful, but there's nothing I can do about that. Whereas Kumatora's could be better, so... Ugh! Oh, fine, I'll give it to Kumatora. Alright, nothing like having an inventory full of grilled chicken. Am I right, fellas? Anyways, because this man really didn't have that much, I didn't need to spend too much on my money. I'm basically at the same place where I was. All I just needed to do was sell a few things. But, here we are, Eonia's house. This kind of reminds me of the same place where I initially found her. Alright, Eonia. We're here, so you know what has to do. Oh, it's so good to see you again. You finally, finally come. Lucas, you always struck me as a bit of, of a crybaby, but you've grown so strong. Jeez, thanks, I fucking guess. Boney, you came with him all this way. Good boy. Shake. Shake? Oh, you don't know any tricks. Lucas, you fool. Put the dog down. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, please, for the love of God, do not put the dog down. All right. Let's see, a slightly plain looking fellow. What was it again? Oh yes, Duster. I knew your name. I was only teasing, dearie. It's a pleasure to meet you, Duster. I know very well that your fate lies in helping cute little Lucas here. Kumatora, I've watched you since you were very little. But this is the prettiest you've ever been now. You're absolutely fabulous. I know you might say, cut that crap out, but it's the truth. Alright, introductions are over. 
By the by, what's in that jar you have in there? It looks easy to drop and easy to roll. Here you go, jar of yummy pickles. Ooh, fabulous! My absolute favorite yummy pickles. You brought them all the way here for me? Thank you. These pickles will be the last thing I eat before I vanish. I'm going to really enjoy them. You don't need to say anything. I understand. Five needles have been pulled now. Aeolia, Doria, Lydia, Phrygia, and Mixie. I mean, Mixolydia. They've all disappeared now that the time has come. And now it's my turn. That leaves only my needle in Chupo Chupo Yoi Temple and that one missing needle. Now, adorable little Lucas, go to the temple. The temple is covered in finds frozen in time. You can't get inside with them as they are. You'll need to sprinkle these waters of time on them. Um, thank you, I guess. You know, physics. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of gonna miss Ionia. She's really been the only one who's been there with me from like the beginnings. I mean, yes, technically I didn't meet Aeolia first, but I don't know. E oh, would you look at that, Mr. Saturn? What's up? What's up, my guy? Polished into shiny sparkling thing. No worries. I give back to you. Oh, whoa. What, what was the thing that I said? What was the thing I said? Editor, please roll the clip. Anyways, how much do I want to bet that this is a Franklin badge? Thank you very much for this Franklin ba badge. Farewell, farewell. Thank you, Mr. Saturn. I don't understand why you need a headband, bandana, whatever it's called. But it looks nice on you. Oh, you're still here. In disguise. <laughs> I can tell. Anyways, as I was saying, I'm kind of going to miss Ionia because... Oh, you're fucking kidding me. I don't even get a chance to talk. Nor do I get a chance to heal! Please, my good sir. I am not ready. I am not ready at all. Can you like, I don't know, maybe put a hot spring somewhere near? And you kill your own man? You kill your own clay man? Yeah, that's right, bucko. That's right, you can't do shit. What do you want, you goddamn oinkers? What are you gonna do? Yeah, that's right, you're gonna do nothing. Or are you just gonna stand there? A pig mask colonel and his cohorts trap you. Uh, okay. I, I almost feel like I should just. I almost feel like I should just defense. What you call it? Defense down, everyone. But uh, offense down, defense. It'd be better if I just do offense down because these guys are still regular enemies. At the end of the day. And let's see here. Boney, I know you got the goods. Uh, Thunderbomb. Yes, sir. Skadoosh. And that didn't do that much. And there's a time bomb. And there's another time bomb. Please don't you dip. Uh oh. Uh oh. Why do you guys get to go before I do? That sucks! Well, at least your defense is down, but still, that sucks! Because of this! Well, you still ate shit, so... I'm just gonna take care of Colonel over here first. And there's a time bomb. And there's a beam. And there's another time bomb. 
That's not good. That's not good at all. Uh, fuck it. I'm this. I'm literally this far, this far down. Might as well just keep going with this. And also, in it is in my best interest to do uh, PK Thunder because if I remember correctly, PK Thunder just does not does not care whether or not you have a PSI shield or not. Yes, sir. No, sir. No, sirree. These guys are still not dead. My brother in Christ. Criminy over here. Thank you. Okay. Now, about that hot spring idea. Are we still down for it? Are we still down for it? All right, bucko. Who the hell do you think you are? I just realized I've been recording for almost an hour. Holy shit. There's no way I actually have an hour of footage. This is just me been coughing all the goddamn time. My cough has been getting worse and yet I have my medication. What is going on? Loser! 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 <laughs> Loser! Fuck! Hey, so remember when I called you a loser? Um, you know, water under the bridge or whatever they say. Um, Akumatora, please, you need to do something here. Um. Uh, Offense down, just please. Both both of you two. I need you to offense down the living crap out of this man. Alright, what is he bad against? Didn't smell anything. Fuck! Offense down by 33. Offense decrease by 60. That's Pog. Oh my god. That is still a good amount of damage. Uh, Dukumatora, let's see here. Uh, you honestly should just heal yourself up, realistically speaking. Uh, freeze him, you know? Pickle stick, let's see if that works. Uh, and he has a shield. There goes his defense. I better not see a PK shield. Let's go. All right, please don't hit Lucas. That is not good. That is not good. Loser, loser, loser. I am just wasting all my grilled chickens on everyone. Uh, blah, 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 blah. First of all, you keep freezing. Second of all, you, uh, what the fuck can you actually do? Uh, scary mask time. You! I know, you have your shield snatcher somewhere. Get that stupid shield out of here. Yeet! That's what I like to see, baby! And your offense is still going down. Eat shit, bucko! No lady, three, god damn! Uh, let's see here. Grilled chicken to bony again! I'm sorry, Duster, but you know, shit like this happens. Which some people get the treatment, uh, get a. Uh, some people are just biased. That, that's that's literally as much as I could say. All right, all right. Still making do with what I have. Not doing so bad right now. Loser! I had no shields. Loser, loser. You use PK love on me? Oh, um, uh, everyone's gonna die, aren't they? Uh, oh, um, I don't know if I. Genuinely do not know if that memento is is useful. 
at all. Uh, well, considering that you have a safe state, I could just save state back. I feel like I'm supposed to lose this battle. I generally feel like I'm supposed to lose this battle. There goes Bony. Uh, fuck it, I guess. If I'm supposed to lose this battle, I lose it. If I don't, then, well, I'll try it again. There goes Lucas. I think he, 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 my, my guy, I, I don't think I need to tell you this, but you are becoming a little bit of a loser if you keep tr if you keep trying to lightning attack me. Oh lord, I still have all these mementos. Maybe that was the point of me losing. God, I I genuinely don't know it at this point anymore. I just admit the feat. I admit that I probably was supposed to die. If for some reason I do not, if for some reason I still win this battle, first of all, you're an absolute fucking loser. And second of all, you just got trashed by fucking Lucas over here. My guy! My guy! I mean, like I was saying, maybe I'm supposed to lose so we could burn through all my mementos? My guy. At this point in time, I feel like it's in my best interest just to fucking guard. Buddy! Buddy! Okay, okay. I'll just wait. I'll wait and see if I'm supposed to lose. Okay, I guess I'm not supposed to lose. That is, um... That is a big concern that I have. How am I not supposed to lose against this masked man when I literally do not have my resources on me? Oh my god, what the hell? Look at that! Look at that! I, I, I had to do this all over again. This is my second try, and I was just focused. I, I just could not say anything. I was just this focused. My God, loser, loser, loser! All right, I probably shouldn't be yelling so loud considering that it's twelve forty a.m. in the morning, but I feel like I should re need to reiterate this. Loser. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Loser. Now then, who the who do you think you, who the fuck do you think you are? All right. He, he's gone. He's gone. Whatever. All right. I saved my game, and now time to sprinkle these waters of time. Please tell me that there's some sort of hot springs over here. Because God forbid I need something to help me heal up to get all my PSI power back. Okay, what's happening? What's going on? What is all this? Am I traveling through space and time? Are these vines wilting? Oh, t a time started flowing again for the vines. Lucas, let's go inside. Please tell me that there's some place for me to heal. Well, at least there's the needle. I don't need to go on a fucking journey and, and above just to go get it, right? Right? Okay. Okay. Walking around here. I know I shouldn't be walking around. It is literally in my best interest to stop walking around and just grab this goddamn needle. Oh, please. 
It was our Majipsi ancestors who sealed away the Dark Dragon. The Gypsies have guarded the Seven Needles for many generations since. Ionia, you could have helped me a little bit with the Masked Man? But the Needles will be pulled when the time comes, and that time is now. The heart of the person who pulls the Needles will be passed on to the Dark Dragon, and then something big will happen. Something big enough to recreate the entire world. Lucas, I want you to be the one who awakens the Dark Dragon. To accomplish this, you can't lose or give in, no matter what. Duster, Boney, and Princess Kumatora. Without heartfelt help from you, his friends, he cannot accomplish this task. Princess Kumatora, this PSI is so dangerous that I never intended to teach it to you. But I'm going to teach it to you right here, right now. Master this dangerous PSI technique so that you can help Lucas. Are you prepared? What? Is it PSI Starstorm? I've already had enough people use Starstorm on me. Uh, okay, okay. So much for not having the fucking Franklin badge. Hey, Starstorm! Thank you very much. I knew Pooh had it. He was the quote unquote special one. And well, Kumatora is also a special one. So, you know, only made sense. All right, let's pull this goddamn needle. So, Ionia, when I pull this needle... I'm going to get text that says everyone in the party was revitalized, correct? Because if I don't, I'm going to be very, very upset. It's already upsetting enough that the people who are watching my videos cannot see how much the game is freaking the fuck out because of my frame rate right now. Unfortunately, I'm only recording on 30 FPS while I'm playing the game on 60. So you... I'm telling you when I say that the game is freaking the fuck out, it is freaking the fuck out. Alright. What do we have here? PK Love Omega. Cool, cool, it's just more PK Love. As I start to disappear, my heart senses an intense disturbance. Locria, the final missing Majipsi, is rapidly nearing the seventh needle. That's what I'm sensing. It's coming from that direction. From a lively, filthy place. Oh, just when I'm about to tell where it is. Oh. Oh, come, come on, Ionia. Please. I'm sorry. I'm disappearing now. Before I go, here are final mementos of me. A razor and lipstick. Remember me sometimes, okay? Thank you. Oh, this will actually be very useful. It's too bad I didn't get to see how everything turns out, but... Lucas, honey. Little Boney. Adorable Duster. And Princess Kumatora. Whatever happens, make sure you get to see what the final fate of the world is. Oh, Locria is nearing the seventh needle. Fuck, man, what now? Ooh, what's happening? Oh, what is happening? Who are the people downstairs? Why is there this lively jazz music over there that I'm listening to? Oh, would you look at that? The end of chapter 7, eh? Well, unfortunately, I didn't get to see whatever else was in that cave. But you know what? Who the fuck cares? Because that is the end of the episode. If you like the episode, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Pixel Love, Memento Mori, and whatnot. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care, everybody.